It's Dave Johan once again, pleased to be joined by someone who's making their debut on Saturday night on a big card. Callum French, how are you, mate? I'm good, mate. Thank you. How are you? I'm excellent. I'm excellent. So making your uh, your debut on this massive card, how does that feel, first of all? Oh, I'm just grateful to be here, mate, over the moon. Um, been boxing in these sports halls in Uzbekistan and Kazakhstan for the past five years, so it's going to be nice to come out and box in front of my friends and family on such a stacked card. Good stuff. How many tickets have you personally sold for this one, being your debut and everything? I've done 150. Uh, got 150 strong coming down from the northeast, so uh, no doubt they'll be making some noise. Good stuff, good stuff. And, and um, signing with uh, with the zone, match room and so on and so forth, did you have many other offers on the table? Was this the premium choice for you? Aye, aye, there was a few offers on the table, but um, when uh, Matchroom and Dazone came in, it was uh, it was a no-brainer for me. I uh, think uh, Dazone and Matchroom, they're the A squad, they've got all the top names, so that's what you want to be. You want to be amongst the top names and on the top bills. Good stuff. Just talk to me about what it's like being, you know, making your pro debut on such a big card. Is there a bit of pressure there in terms of, like, you want to over-impress, you want to go for a KO? How, how, does, it, how does that play in your mind sort of thing because before shows we're behind closed doors weren't we with everything going on nah pressure's for car tyres mate uh, it just kind of enjoy the experience really like I've boxed under high pressure situations in the past um, at major competitions all over the world so this is just another bout it's just a just a boxing ring and me opponent across from us and don't really let the uh, the crowd and the the, the environment uh, bother us it's just a fight at the end of the day for me Good stuff. And what's what's the? I mean, we don't want to overlook it, but next year, ideally, how many times do you want to be out of there in terms of four, four times, five times, or? Yeah, of course, mate. I want to be as busy as possible. Um, obviously, uh, just starting my career now, so get the ball rolling with this fight on Saturday, and then uh, push on into the new year, and um, hopefully get four or five fights next year. Maybe it's more, as as many as I can, as many as I can. Good stuff. Um, Northeast. Boxing City, obviously, we've got Glenn McCrory, former world champion in there. We also had Josh Pretty Boy Kelly, Northeast as well. Uh, just to name but two people. What's it like being part of that? I wouldn't say legacy as such, but being part of that club, should we just say? Um, it's exciting. It's um, the new the new batch are coming through as well. Obviously, it's a be, been a bit quiet up in the Northeast for the past couple of years. It's just been Lewis Ritson selling out the arena. So now that the um, the new batch, the new talent are coming through, I think we're going to take uh, the professional game by storm. And uh, Newcastle or Sunderland, mate, or Middlesbrough? Which one are you? Newcastle. Newcastle, definitely. All day St James's Park, one day world title. That's all I'm talking. About. Good stuff. Where can people follow you, Callum? Um, follow us on Instagram, Callum Fringe underscore, Twitter, Callum Fringe underscore, Facebook, LinkedIn, everything, anywhere you want. And follow us down the show if you want. Get a ticket. Good stuff. All the best, mate, from the Boxing Voice on Saturday night. Cheers. Thanks very much, mate. Cheers. Cheers, mate. Enjoy the video. Feel free to hit the like, subscribe, and share. As always, if you want to support us to the next level, head over to the Patreon dot com backslash the boxing voice we have tons of exclusive from border wars and title betting shows the list goes on and on and on but in addition to that if you guys have questions for fighters trainers and promoters this is where you can submit them we will run out get these questions answered and put it back on the show just for you guys appreciate it peace